like Chef said, I traveled back and forth from Houston to Austin several days a week, and then in between I stayed at a local bed and breakfast. And along the way of any adventure, new friends come along to support you and encourage you. Never be arrogant. This is the one thing, one message that I'd like to uh, leave with you. Never think that you know it all. It's a continuing learning process, but be confident in what you can do. I was totally surprised and overwhelmed by the support and nurturing that I received and our whole class received as our experience here. Uh, Chef Tammy was constantly encouraging us in person and by text and on our grade book and it wasn't in generality she was also very specific about things that we made individually and commented on them and I mean you might have a paragraph on your grade book of the things that she was complimenting you about that's a gift to not just say great job but to actually pick out the things you did that day although the common thread between us as students is that we came to Escoffier to study culinary arts that wasn't exactly the main goal of Escoffier and the chef instructors. As with any educational inst institution or experience, the main goal of your instructors is to teach you to be a learner. Because being a learner is far more valuable than any title that you can attain. Being a learner ensures that you indeed have a future worth pursuing. A learner is never obsolete, never overqualified or underqualified. A learner works harder than they think they should have to because they see the value of the education that they're receiving and the future that it will provide for them. A learner is a company's best asset, and nobody knows that more than the one that owns the company. A few years ago, when Jack Lawson came to me and said, uh, <clears throat> I'd like you to be part of an online culinary education, I said, You've got to be kidding, right? That's the stupidest thing I ever heard. Um, and then, <laughs> well, the, the stupid person in the room was me because uh, after I saw the demo and the, the explanation of, them, of what it was, I was pretty much convinced, so I said yes. But actually, after my visit here now, I'm even more convinced. Uh, you know, I went through uh, an Ivy League college that was, you know, 150 people in a room getting a lecture and the professor's reading from the book, that the same book that's in front of you because you've been forced to buy it. And you just, you just knew at the time, this was an enormous waste of time. But after I saw the online education, I thought, this is absolutely brilliant. I mean, I could be at home, I could be traveling, I could be in the kitchen and being educated. Now, you know, it doesn't get better than that. <laughs>